Jack built a business using ChatGPT4 and in less than five hours, his business was already valued at $25,000 and he had started a movement. It is such a mind blowing case that we have to talk about it here on this channel. And if you haven't been following his journey over the past 48 hours on Twitter and the movement broadly, then you are in for a treat. You are going to be mind blown just as much as I am. So in this video, I'm going to walk you through uh, the story of how I guess Jack accidentally kind of started this huge movement that now involves more than 30 people also building alongside and joining this movement that is now called Hustle GPT. And at the end, I will share some of my takeaways so that you can take this wild story and, you know, make it a part of your own story and think about how you can implement this into your lives as well. Before I start talking about the story and how it unrolled, just a quick statement on why I wanted to make this video. So I've been wanting to cover AI and the topic of side hustles or starting one person businesses or escaping the nine to five because that was the most requested type of content uh, in a recent poll. And I realized that this story sits right at the intersection and there's a lot of things to take away and take action on. So let's get started. Main character of this story is Jackson Fall, who's probably a guy who was just living a very normal life until only 48 hours ago. And he gives this prompt to GPT-4. You are Hustle GPT, an entrepreneurial AI. I'm your human counterpart. I can act as a liaison between you and the physical world. He gives it $100 and the only goal is to turn that into as much money as possible in the shortest time possible. So uh, he also mentions no manual labor, which is an important piece. Anyway, so he starts to share his journey on Twitter as a thread and the game plan is setting up an affiliate marketing site, making content around eco-friendly and sustainable living products. So. It's all coming from GPT-4. It is giving the details of the plan, uh, where to buy the domain and hosting, and they are also doing a cash flow calculation as uh, they make business decisions. So Jack also uses Dolly, another AI tool to make the logo. He's apparently a branding designer, so he's being a little bit picky about it. They create the logo, they come up with the affiliate links, and then they write the first article on the website. The, the website at this point was not even mobile friendly, but it was there and this was all happening under a couple of hours. Uh, GPT has spoken, we will allocate exactly $40 USD to Facebook and Instagram ads. And by this time, his tweet thread had started to pick up and people had started to follow his journey because it was just such an interesting experiment. When I started following his tweets, the whole thread had probably had about maybe 500,000 impressions. Right now, I believe it's at close to 18 million impressions. So imagine how big it became. So in the effort of building in public, he's sharing everything in the thread and this is where people actually start to really follow through and they started commenting like crazy. They wanted to advertise and this is actually the first ad, which was by the way, approved by Hustle GPT. I was like following the story in real time as this was happening and he got $65 in cash for this. So here, I wanted to show this one, right? This is DMs are flooded, cash on hand um, is over $1,000 at this point. This is only a couple of hours into the experiment, a value that $25,000, his DMs are flooded. There were so many influential people in, um, in the replies and in his DM box as well per his uh, tweets, of course. People wanted to invest in the company at this stage. So now we are in day three of uh, this experiment and he keeps updating uh, Twitter and his new Twitter following with all the uh, all the new prompts that he's giving to us GPT. And I believe the latest update is that he had asked um, it to build the cash, build the revenue to $100,000 was the latest update. And now these are some of the crazy stats as well. So 50,000 followers uh, in 48 hours. He's now close to 60,000 as of making this video. CNN Newsroom wants to do a segment on Hustle GPT. Um, and he's even asking like, how what to talk about on CNN newsroom 
to Hustle GPT, which is GPT-4 basically. Someone created a Discord server uh, so that he could actually make money from subscriptions because people wanted to follow along. He, that guy also built a GPT-4 bot into the server as well so that they would be able to, I guess, track the the conversations in real time within discord so now people are also kind of i guess flooding into discord as well so here we've got at least 150 plus people building side hustles on gpt4 and someone in fact made a github repo of 30 plus projects of people currently building businesses building side projects using gpt4 and sharing them publicly on Twitter. So there were so many other threads that Jack was also retweeting or commenting, which is how I was able to you know, come across all the other uh, examples, the other projects that people were building. But now imagine there's 30 plus projects and maybe even more than that, that we are not really tracking, um, that people are using GPT-4 to build projects. And look at the stats. Now he has 7,812 0.84 dollars cash on hand and he is in fact hiring uh, I think a developer if I remember correctly and a copywriter that is only going to be using GPT-4 to create articles for the website because this guy obviously has a full-time job and now he's also busy being an influencer too so he needs a copywriter to support him with the content on the website anyway so he's going to be continuing this experiment for the next 30 days if you wanted to follow along um, I think this is just absolutely uh, fantastic and very very interesting so do give him a follow and follow his journey and maybe take it a step further and here are some of the takeaways now that I wanted to share with you right number one why this is such a wild example is because this guy just thought out of the box like he was not afraid to be creative and be curious and open-minded and he zagged when everyone was zigging basically so you know while everyone was using GPT-4 or GPT broadly as an assistant he kind of turned it around and he said i am your assistant now treat me as your human counterpart and help me build a business or i will help you build a business i guess so the the takeaway here is don't wait for anyone's permission be curious and be open-minded and be imaginative and that is a big takeaway that I am taking for myself as well. Number two is you don't have to follow a certain path or scheme to build a side hustle. I know there are thousands of other videos on YouTube and other platforms that talk about building side hustles. What are some ideas that you could build on? But I think you can create your own path just like Jack did here. He might not make a lot of money from it, but who knows, he might end up turning this into a big business. But nonetheless, I'm sure that even if he does not continue this experiment, this will open up so many other doors for him. And I think that's absolutely worthwhile. Uh, of his time and his attention to doing this. So I think the, the big takeaway here is to not necessarily feel that you have to follow someone else and don't think that the side hustle ideas that are shared on YouTube or elsewhere are the ultimate list that you need to follow. You can do your own thing as well. And number three, GPT-4 is a great assistant. It is a superpower that can really level you up and help you save a lot of time which is i think maybe the biggest benefit of using ai on a day-to-day -day basis and getting through your daily tasks maybe so take advantage of it take advantage of ai to, in the sense that you know make it your assistant and be creative with it be playful hope this entertained you and amazed you as much as it did for me I'm still mind blown and I will be following his journey. And in fact, I'm also thinking for the past now one and a half days, if I should also start playing around and maybe get the help from DPT4 to build something that I've been wanting to do for a while. So while I go ahead and think about that, I encourage you to think about what you can build and what you want to do with uh, AI as well. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video and had some takeaways like I did. I'll see you in the next one. Take care guys. Bye bye.